people have called us? Some people have called us. A leaderless movement. A leaderless movement. But we're not a leaderless movement, really. We're not a leaderless movement, really. We're a movement of leaders. We're a movement of leaders. So put up your hands if you're in charge. Now, the media, the media and the city, and the city are, very stressed out. are very stressed out. Cause they want to know, cause they want to know who's in charge. Who's in charge? So let's tell them, so let's tell them who's in charge. Who's in charge? We have to take out all these loans to be able to afford school, but then we're supposed to pay them back. But then if there's no jobs for us to be able to pay them back, how are we supposed to want to go to school and want to continue to get our education and, you know, want to get better? And how are we supposed to become professionals if we can't even afford the degrees to become professionals? with corporations or is it with government or both? Most. The corporations own the government. The Republican Party is a wholly owned subsidiary of the corporations and, and the, uh, the Democrats are not much better. We know that we're being lied to by the media. We're being told, we're being distracted from what's really going on. If we stand our ground, if we stand our ground, people will be forced to listen. People will be forced to listen. Revolution is now! Revolution is now! Uh, Native people are saying you can't keep living like this. It is a struggle for all people, for all human beings on this earth. Uh, traditional people of the Autumn Territory have lost their water because of corporate greed, because of uh, the expansion of America. Uh, so we're struggling to get the message out there to the people, these 99 percenters, we're not part of that. We're not even 99% of that. We have a higher unemployment rate. We have a higher death rate. We have a higher um, uh, unsuccessful rate of people going to school. Uh, we struggle quite a bit in the reservation in the communities. Porque cada día que pasa nacen más guerreros con mentes incorruptibles, indestructibles, que siguen gritando. El pueblo vive preparado va a recuperar todo lo nuestro. Y esto es más cierto que destino manifiesto. Make some noise! Yes, yes. Wow! Straight truth. There's a sign going on that my homie Ernesto Yerena did. It's called Decolonize Wall Street. But we shouldn't just decolonize Wall Street. We shouldn't just decolonize Arizona, Palestine, or the world. We should also decolonize our minds. We should start by decolonizing our minds and, of course, our young minds. Thank you. We used to have a voice! We used to have a voice! And that was our politicians. And that was our politicians. But corporate America. 
But corporate America owns our politicians now. Owns our politicians now. We are here to say. We are here to say that America is no longer a rich man. America is no longer a rich man. An uninvolved teenager. An uninvolved teenager. Or an ignorant adult. Or an ignorant adult. We are America. We are America. And when someone tells you, and when someone tells you to show them what democracy looks like, to show them what democracy looks like, just like our friends in New York, just like our friends in New York, 